We begin with that breaking news in the motorcycle road rage case. CBS 2 broke the story moments ago, and tonight, we can tell you an NYPD officer has been arrested and charged in connection with the violent incident that ended in the beating of a driver. CBS 2's Tony Aiello is live in our newsroom with more. Tony? Dana, video not yet made public shows an off-duty officer banging on the Range Rover that was chased and cornered by those angry bikers. CBS News correspondent John Miller reports that cop was picked up this afternoon and will soon, uh, and will soon face charges, something along the lines of criminal mischief. Commissioner Kelly hinted at a pending arrest earlier today. Day. We have put uh, a police officer on modified assignment and the investigation is going forward. That's all Commissioner Kelly had to say publicly about one of the more disturbing aspects of the motorcycle mayhem. At least three and perhaps as many as five NYPD officers were out riding with bikers on September 29th when a frightened motorist gunned his SUV, critically injuring a biker and leading to a chase that ended with the driver being beaten in front of his frightened family. We've We've learned one of the officers riding on that Sunday is a narcotics detective named Samir Gonsalves. He made news in April when he was busted for pushing an officer who was trying to break up an argument between Gonsalves and his girlfriend. Former department spokesman John Miller, now senior correspondent for CBS This Morning, says a second biker with a badge is an undercover assigned to internal affairs. The irony there, of course, is they're the ones who track down police for misconduct. He's been assigned there about three weeks. Uh, he hadn't started his undercover assignment yet, but he was riding along, and he is, he is talking to his lawyers about whether to meet with prosecutors or be questioned by police. So the NYPD hasn't interviewed him yet. Again this afternoon, John Miller has learned of an arrest of an off-duty cop. That officer told investigators he saw the motorcycle mayhem but didn't participate. Sources say his story was contradicted by video showing him banging on the SUV. He's not expected to be charged with actually hitting the SUV driver. Live in the newsroom, Tony Aiello, CBS 2 News. Tony, Dana. thank you. In addition tonight, the NYPD has released photos of four additional riders police would like to question in the motorcycle road rage case. Here are the images, these riders, the pictures made public by police today. They followed the release of two other bikers' photos yesterday. Meantime, a fourth suspect was arraigned in the case. Craig Wright is accused of stomping twice on Alexian Lien, the driver of the SUV who was dragged out of his car.